afternoon everybody i hope you're all well um i've come on today because i'm going to make a card from this beautiful paper pad that i've got off my lovely bestie who is carla so i've been having a look through it and i'm just going to choose which paper i want i'm spoiled for choice with this I've got the 12 by 12 as well, as you've seen in my other video um, that you got me for my birthday. But I'm going to use this 8 by 8 Um, I've got a car blank. I got these from Home Bargains, I think. Not sure on what they measure. It might be 6 by 6 So I'm just looking through to see. See, I like that one. But if I was to do that, then I wouldn't. Oh, I don't know. As I said, I'm spoiled for choice. Um, see, I quite like that one, and I've got the cutter parts, but I really do like that one. But it's seeing which one will go with it. See, I like that one as well. As I said, I'm really, really spoiled for choice, and I don't want to put gold on gold. And I don't want this video to take forever. I hope you're all you are all doing well on this beautiful day. Absolutely gorgeous outside. I sat outside, I could only manage 10 minutes. Because the heat was just knocking me sick. So I'm sat in the back kitchen where it's nice and cool. Um, And I thought, why not come out and make a card? Let's see, I like that one. Okay, so we'll go with this one. And I'm thinking maybe this. Or maybe this way. No, I don't like it that way. So let's see. See, that's quite nice. Because these are some of them are double sided papers, you see. And I do like that one. Okay, let's take this out and see which goes better. And I want. One of these cutter parts. I'm not very good at fussy cutting, but <coughs> I'll give it a go. <clears throat> see that. I don't know what to do it on that background or this background. Yeah, I'll do it on this background. I do like that. So I'll just have to measure this. First time I'm using this, so let me see what it measures before I cut it. So I think it's a six by six. Yeah, it's six by six. So this six by six this makes life a whole lot easier instead of getting me scoreboard down so I'll go with that and hopefully I've worked it out right no, I haven't I just have to pull another card out and it's a tiny tiny too big so let me see it's just going to take a bit of getting used to with this so if I put that let's see if I take inches 
Yes. And where is this loose? I'll push it back down. So, if I take maybe. Bear with me, guys, because as I said, this is the first time I've used this. Guy. I want to get it right. Yep, we need to take a bit more off. That's it. Yeah, the card's not straight, but I can just trim that anyway in a minute. So let's put this wet glue on here. Let's hope it works. some reason it always seems to clog up and that's my dog you can hear in the background that's because I'm not paying any attention to her I have got the dog bed right next to me but no doubt she wants picking up and this is what I get 24-7 Let's glue this down here. And with using wet glue, you can actually adjust it, which makes life a whole lot easier for me. As you can see, there's a bit of a gap, but I'll cut that in the guillotine in a minute once it's all stuck down. So we want this a bit less than a six by six so we'll go say five and a half and five and three quarters and we've got a bit going on but i need to take a touch more off the edge Because I want the pattern to be showing a bit and that's not straight. Let me see. Yeah, I like that. That's better. So, we're going to glue this on the back of it. I really, this is the bane of my life, this glue, you know. It really, really is. I mean, I've got two new ones, but there's a lot still left in this. If it comes to it, I'll just use my double-sided tape. Which I do like using. I've seen a couple of ladies with the nibs on the bottles and I need to ask them where did they get them from because it'll make life a lot easier using one of them. So, let's put this in the middle. Yeah. 
yeah, I like that. So we'll smooth that down. And I need to cut the edge of this. But I'll use my scissors for this because... It'll just make life a little bit easier than putting it in the guillotine. That's better. So as I said, we've got these um, cut parts that you get as well on the paper pad. So I'm just wondering... I like this Believe in Yourself with the elephant on it so let me just cut this out Check me stamps in a minute. Let me have a look. No, that looks too much. We have this be happy as well. Let me just cut these out. I just have to be very careful I don't cut any of the others out by accident or cut through it. Let me see. See, I quite like that there, but maybe here, no. Sorry this is taking forever guys, as I said this is the first card I've made. all these up anyway. See, so quite like that. Oh, there's one of these two. See, I like that one. And I like that one. Um, let's see. Let's see, I'm not fussed on that one. Let me see on this. If you have any hints about cards, guys, please let me know. I've not long started making cards. I do like them. Just let me see what that's like behind here. Let's see that in the middle. 
Yeah, I like that in the middle. I do like that in the middle. So I'm going to go with that in the middle. I'm not going to change my mind. And put some foam pads on it to raise it up. Let me see. just need to put around it because that's annoying me really I should use the guillotine because that's what it's for He's just sitting there crying as per usual. She's very spoilt. By me, of course. Yeah, that's better. Let's move that out of the way. So, I'll put this here in the middle. And we'll raise it up. And she'll probably be glad when I finish filming this because I'll be able to give her cuddles then. Because that's all she wants is cuddles all the time. Isn't it, Tia? Just want cuddles all the time. I hate these stickies from... I think I got them from Home Bargains and they're awful. If anybody has any suggestions on where to get these foam pads and the double-sided foam pads I'd really like to know which shop you go and get it from because as you can see it just pulls out and it, like makes a mess but because I've got these I want to use them up anyway I don't want them sitting lying around and not using them and going to waste because as you crafters know we don't like anything going to waste So that's that. Let's take these off. Should be easy to do, yes. Yeah, I found, I mean, I got these and the double sided in the roll. I got one from Home Bargains and one from Poundland. And then I went to one below and I also got them from there. And it's like they're using the same manufacturer who's doing them but Poundland used to do a fantastic one before they changed over and I didn't have no problems with it whatsoever and this these foam pads and the foam tape it is absolutely awful I really don't like working with it but as I said I'm going to use these all up So, let's put that there. Yeah, I like that. I know it needs something else, but what? I don't know. Let's see. That's too much purple. I don't like that. We don't want another elephant. We do have this nice flower. But that's purple on purple. Let me see. But we do have that and it's like a tag. So let me cut around it and let's have a look. Use my little scissors for this. Because if I don't like, because it looks like a tag, I can always make it into a banner. And now I've got a little stamp in the drawer next to me. Let's see what it's like. I'm a terrible, messy person, aren't I? But 
I'll clean that. Right, let me see. I have got a hell punch, but I don't know where it is. At all. Let me see. Let's see if I can get away with making this into... And she's still crying. You'll have to excuse me for one moment while I open the door. Come on, here you go. Now I've opened the door and now you don't want to go out, which is typical. Oh, she's gone in now. Sorry I'm being quiet guys, I'm just concentrating. So, maybe we could put this here, not up here, or maybe here. Yeah, let's have a look at that. Stamps I've got, I know I've got a tiny little stamp. Tiny little stamp in the Cadeau de Jour one. And it's a little banner and it says with love. Let me see if it'll fit in first. Yeah, that'll fit in. So I need to get. So I'm just going to stamp this out, hope it turns out okay. Oh, that's nice, I like that. And I'm going to raise this up as well. I think I could do with something extra on on the card itself. So I think I might have. that with a piece. Because I don't want that line flat. Ah, there it is. What time am I on? 24 minutes guys, I do apologise. 
as I said, it takes me a while to make a card because I'm only just starting out, really. And I'm enjoying making cards, actually. I do prefer pocket letters, though. <laughs> and sending happy mail out. See what I mean with this? It just won't go. I had long nails last week. And then, all of a sudden, they started snapping. Got it. So we'll put that maybe about here. Yeah. So I do like that. I'm full of ink, as you can see. Look at all this. I need to wipe it down. Um, it does need something in the corners. I have got some gems. Ah. And I'm debating what colours to put. I mean, I know there's purple tones, but this blue actually goes quite nice. use this blue actually so we have I have these teeny tiny ones and I want to put these on the side of these I don't want that there. We'll put that one here. Yeah, I like that. And then we have these big ones here. And I might put them over this side actually. So, there's the card I've made. I hope you like it. I said, it's my first one. And I'm loving that paper pad. I've got a few more ideas for it. I'm just wondering whether this blue goes with the tone. When I'm looking at it, it does. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a like. And subscribe to my channel if you'd like to. And thank you for watching. And bye.